Hello guys and welcome back to the Minecraft Mon tutorial. In today's episode, we're going to create a custom slab. So let's get started. Inside of your init blocks, create a new package called .slab. As it involves three classes, so we'll put it in a different package. And let's create custom block slab, custom block double slab, and custom block half slab. Close half and double. We're just going to work on custom block slab for now. Make it an abstract class. An abstract class is something where we can extend off something, but we don't have to use every single one of its functions. And so we are going to extend block slab, of course. Control Shift O to import. We're obviously going to have to add the material. We can remove it from the constructor and just have string name and super material iron. Then set the unlocalized name and registry name as normal and delete the to do. Then since there can be a state of half or full block, we're going to do i block state state is equal to this dot block state dot get base state and import i block state. Then there's the function um, is double. So if this dot is double with an exclamation mark at the beginning, meaning that it's not double. So if it's not double, state is equal to state dot with property half enum block half dot bottom. So if it's not double, which means it's a half slab, we set it to a half slab. It's very simple. We're obviously going to set the default state to be the default state, and we're going to use neighbor brightness. This dot use neighbor brightness is equal to true. That is the constructor done. We are going to use get unlocalized name and return this dot get unlocalized name these are all functions that are in the block slab that we need get variant property return half get type from item return emum block half dot bottom as a bottom slab or a top slab so we say it to the bottom slab damage dropped return zero this is just if when once it's been mined does it lose any durability? Since it's a block, it doesn't, can't lose durability, so we return zero. Get state from meta. If it's not double, return this dot get default state dot with property half. And then this is a quite complicated string. Enum block half dot values array meta percent enum block half dot values dot length what this is doing is getting the default state um, of the thing which we set to just be the base state you get it as a half block and then it figures out if there's any metadata by using the values length so find out how many versions there is and then it registers them all and then return this dot get default state so if we don't have any metadata then just return the default states next one is very similar get meta from state is the opposite to get a state from meta. If this dot is double, then return zero. Sorry, if it's not double, return zero. Return double brackets, open double brackets, enum block half state dot get value half dot ordinal plus one that needs to be 
close bracket dot ordinal plus one. What this is doing, if it's not double, it doesn't have anything. And if it wants to get the metadata, it gets the value of half and converts it to an ordinal number. Sorry if that's a bit confusing, you just need to know that this get meta from state thing here. It's useful in the creation of our custom slab. We need to get the item dropped. Just return item dot get item from block block in it dot um our tutorial we haven't actually created it yet, so block in it dot tutorial underscore slab half it'll obviously drop the half variant and then create block state new block state container which inside wants um, block and its property so the block is going to be this and the property is going to be new i property half import i property with control shift o oops sorry about that it means to be i property right angle brackets then curly brackets half so an i property array of half that's the block state you need to create so I'll leave that there that everything done now in custom block um, custom block half slab sorry it's going to extend custom block slab and I'm going to add the add the constructor and super off the name function and then is double is a half slab so we return false save that and in custom block double slab extends custom block slab but it returns true as it is a double slab so just add the constructor is double return true so it is a double slab and the other one isn't a double slab now we need to go into our block in it actually create these things so public static block um, tutorial underscore slab half and tutorial underscore slab double we need to initialize them both Tutorial slab half is equal to new custom block. No, yep, custom block half slab. Um, and then it's going to be tutorial slab half, of course, and tutorial slab double equal to new custom block slab double custom block double slab and tutorial slab double for register block we actually need to create a new register block function block block comma item block item block instead of this we don't actually need it anymore item block dot set register name block the register name and register item block then 
that's like everything done. We now need to um, we need to use in our register blocks register block is going to be tutorial slab half and then new item slab you can import item slab and it wants the default tutorial slab half then you want tutorial slab half again and then tutorial slab double oh we need to actually here we need to make these their own thing block double slab and custom block half slab as this only takes in um, block slabs well it wants the normal block then a block slab then a block slab so tutorial slab half tutorial slab half tutorial slab double and that is everything now for models and textures once again we don't actually need a texture as we're just going to be using models and I am going to be copying it from my test mod once again and there we go as we can see when you place one slab then two slabs it goes into a tutorial block shape so if you have enjoyed this video or found it useful please hit the like button down below and subscribe for more videos if you've missed any of them I'll leave the playlist link in the description down below or at the end of this video thanks for watching guys my name has been Harry and goodbye